So Ceridian's been performing uh, client-facing audits for uh, decades, uh, back to when they were the uh, SAS 70 audits. And uh, of course, those have now changed to the, uh, the SOC uh, SSAE 16 and 18. Uh, we also perform uh, ISO audits, uh, NIST audits, and FedRAMP certifications, as well as a number of uh, locally required uh, back-end taxing authority and uh, payroll audits. What we really wanted was something that offered uh, workflow, which Audit Board had, but uh, the key difference for Audit Board was that it also offered the ability to uh, create a bit of a document or audit library of our evidence that we were capturing from our control owners and that we could then use that audit evidence that we captured and deploy it across the various frameworks so that we didn't have to go out multiple times asking the control owners for the same thing. Because we're a fairly mature organization, we had all of our frameworks established and all the controls established as well. So we utilize the tools within Audit Board to map the controls uh, across the various frameworks. We're lucky enough that the, the timing worked out and we were able to uh, transition to the cross-comply uh, for the use for of uh, all of our frameworks and audits uh, for our clients facing audits. The workflow, which was uh, key to our uh, utilization and some of the benefits that we were able to achieve uh, was uh, in use uh, by some of our control owners already because some of the control owners work on both the uh, payroll products and the uh, the tools that are audited under SOX. So those uh, folks were uh, quite used to it and were already asking us, uh, you know, why can't you use this tool as well? Uh, we were using a combination of manual requests, uh, SharePoint, uh, workflows for a, a very small amount of things, but the users were asking us to adopt something similar. Uh, so they were obviously uh, very easy to get uh, onto the, the audit board workflow, but uh, those that uh, were, were new to it also found it very intuitive and very straightforward and were very appreciative. We did that all with the same number of people while we're undergoing a significant global expansion. One of the advantages that we saw in terms of uh, cost was that because our auditors uh, were able to reuse evidence and uh, we could now combine a couple of audits together, so our shared services audits could be combined into one overarching audit. That whole process of taking those 16 touch points down to two annually for our uh, shared controls. Our external audit fees dropped significantly uh, such that uh, our savings was actually more than what we paid for Audit Board. Although we've certainly experienced lots of benefits on my team and uh, we're an organization that's growing very quickly, adding new frameworks and expanding globally. And we've been able to support that growth uh, with our existing staff. One of the biggest benefits uh, that probably isn't financial in nature, uh, but is still very real is uh, on the part of our control owners. Uh, they used to always say, you know, when am I supposed to do my day job? Uh, just being inundated by audit request after audit request. And we don't get that anymore. Uh, we get timely responses. Uh, the workflow makes it easy for them to uh, provide the evidence. The, uh, the way we've structured our, our audits and our uh, evidence library means that in some cases they just put us on a regular distribution list and they don't hear from us for literally months at a time. So our relationships with our control owners have improved significantly. And if you've ever been tired of hearing that familiar refrain, when am I supposed to do my job? Well, Audit Board solved that problem for us. Mm -hmm.